Right, so I'm going to show you the cheat that I learned when I was young. Um, <clears throat> first, we're going to have to uh, get this place. So as soon as you beat the Diaz mission, you're good to go. You own the mansion. So um, I've heard of this working if you own any other property. All you need is a garage. So we're going to go ahead and now we're going to go and steal a cop car. Um, so I'm going, to, I'm going to show you exactly where you can get the cop car. I know it's long and boring for the people that have already played the game, but I want to show you exactly where you can get one. Oh shit! Alright, so we're here. <clears throat> so, we can just... Get out. Go steal a cop car. And I was probably making those weird noises because I've activated the cheat like <laughs> a whole bunch of times. I mean, look at my money at the top, right? Does that make sense for just owning the Diaz mansion? So I'm going to show you how I did this. So now we're going to go over and we're going to park this sucker in the garage. And people say, oh, it only gave me $117. It's not a cheat. No, bud, you're doing it wrong. So first what you're going to want to do is get out of the car. Get in this car, move it, because you don't want it blowing up in your face. Take the cop car. And I didn't even need anybody to tell me this. I just figured this out on my own. Oh shit, I already have a car in here. Alright, so we're going to get rid of this car. Hit a bunch of our guys. I guess I could steal that money and that gun while I'm... Oh. I need money. No, you don't. Okay, so now I want to straighten up this cop car a little bit because as we're doing it, it will move a little bit. Oops. Okay, so as soon as you get the cop car in, you're going to want to press the vigilante mission, which is R3. And then you're going to want to get out of the vehicle, wait for the door to close. R2, L2, R1, L1. L2, R2, box, triangle, circle, box, L2, L1. Okay, so $50. Now we keep going, guys. Don't stop, because this is going to, like, this is going to blow your mind, I'm telling you. It'll basically bring you up to every freaking ounce of money that you can get, which is pretty damn cool to me. So you just keep going with it, guys. Make sure that you get far enough away from the vehicle where it's not going to blow your ass up too. Um, but yeah, I hope this helped. And I mean, it gives you more and more each time you do it. If you do it about two, if you do it um, about 50, 60 times, you're going to get the amount that I have at the top. Now, it's not recommended to save your game after, but let's get real. Who the hell's going to do this, get all that money, and not freaking save it? Now, I know that with some cheats on the game, you can actually um, stop the cheat by re-entering it in again. Now, I'm going to stop the, vi uh, the vigilante mission because, obviously, you guys get the point now. So, yeah, I hope this helped you.